Hello, everybody. Check I'm not muted. Hello, everybody. It's Fenton here. Hello, puzzle fans. That's what I say, innit? I haven't done that in, in a little while, it feels like. Hello, puzzle fans. This is Hex Cells, not to be confused with In Cells. That was my partner's joke. I said I'd use it. I thought it was pretty good. This is Hex Cells. Everyone's like, have you ever played Hex Cells? Have you ever played Hex Cells? No, I haven't flipping played Hex Cells, right? I've played Hex Logic on Android. Seem to be exactly the same. But it's in the Steam sale in a bundle for like two quid, under two quid for three whole games. So, alright. What on earth? Let's do 1-1, one, one, shall we? Much like Mario, it's a place to start. Cl correctly mark all orange cells blue or black to solve the puzzle. The number in a cell tells you how many adjacent cells are blue. It's Minesweeper, then. It's Minesweeper, basically. But I believe it is much like Hex Logic, designed to be perfectly solvable. Was that a mistake? That's because I don't know how to do the flipping. Restart, restart, restart. Left is to reveal... No, left is what I want. I want to click where there's twos. And I want to right click where there's nothing. Okay, that's fine. So there's only two here. It's, it's Tometsi, isn't it? It's Tometsi as well. Why was that a mistake? Oh yeah, of course. Don't worry, don't mind me, I'm just I'm just an idiot. I got hexagons for doing it. Let me retry. This is obviously the issue with Tometsi as well, is that you especially in the smaller, easier levels, it was very easy to just uh, go back in and, and do it again. Obviously that's not very becoming on on video. Right, so this is a zero, so we can click both of these. That's a one, that's a one. This one is now satisfied here, so we can click this, that's fine. This is a zero, so we can get rid of these. This is a zero, zero, that one is there. This one has to be this one, but then that one is satisfied. This two has to be these two, but then this two is now satisfied. This two has to be there. Oh, I right clicked instead of left clicked. I'm just having to get used to which way around I want everything to be. I'm doing it too quickly for my own good. Wow, look at this one. So you want to left click the numbers. The left click is to reveal. No, it's the opposite of that. That's now this. This is now fine. That must be this one. Yep. I wasn't thinking about what I was doing. I was thinking about which button I wanted to press on the mouse. Which I suppose, in a manner of speaking, is, is that. What? What's this one? Oh, because there's five remaining. I'll be able to tell at the end whether this one is uh, acceptable or not. Did this come out before or after Tometsi? Oh, I've flipping clicked the wrong side of the mouse again. There's two remaining, so both of these must be blue. I think that's probably where I'm going wrong, is that Tometsi was like the other way around on the mouse. I played that game for like 100 hours because it was incredible. I'm also pretty sure that was the first game I covered on this channel. Fact fans. Uh, so how is the channel going then, seeing as uh, there's not really much going on here at the moment? How is how is the channel going? I think it's going alright. i played a lot of Factorio recently, and if that's not your jam, that's totally fine. I'm trying to make sure that there is something for everybody. Um, and I still have the general issue with the whole puzzle game thing that I can't cover a lot of puzzle games because I have to sort of, I have to buy them all. I have to buy them all. Your boy doesn't get anything for free. And neither should he, to be honest with you. I'm not suggesting I should. Uh, so when there's a sale on, it's quite good. And when there's demos, that's also good. You probably noticed that I've right clicked instead of left clicked. And seeing as it was the first thing I did, I'm going to just start it again. Uh, I could do Let's Plays, of course, but I find that a Let's Play it kind of puts the pressure on me to actually be enjoying to be enjoying it. If I'm not enjoying it, then uh, 
but like with the Talos Principle, I found that to be, it got, it got extremely samey for me. Very quickly. And as such, I kind of, I loathed to boot it up, to do it, to, to start a video. And so then when I, uh, when Epic Games crashed on me and I uninstalled it and I didn't realise I'd lose all my save progress and I did lose all my save progress, I was like, oh no. Seven remaining. It's got to be one of these, it's got to be one of these. If it was this, then it wouldn't be this, which means uh, three. Oh no, it's here. It's here. I just, I just noticed. So that means it's not this one. It means it is this one, not this one, not this one. Definitely this one. One of these two. One of these two. One of these two. So definitely one. This could just be here. Oh no, because this one has to be here. Okay, I'm overcomplicating it. Clearly. Don't make a mistake at the last minute by um, forgetting which way to left click and to right click. We did it. We did all six of those little ones. We got a flipping achievement for it as well. What does this in the middle mean? Does this mean how many hexagons we need to unlock? Yeah. I don't know which ones of these I did without making a mistake. Because I definitely did do some mistakes. Let's assume that it's not important. Alright, world two. Different mechanics? No? Okay. Possibly just some harder logical puzzles to be sorted. Yes. Let's see where this is going already. So there's only three remaining. If it were this one, this would be a, a no and a no, which means that there would be two remaining with only one square left. So it has to be all of these and not this one. Logic. Logic bombed. SJW wrecked compilation. Is there any way I can, like, do everything around a number that I know is safe to reveal everything on straight away? The answer seems to be no. I flipping left clicked instead of right clicked again. So it's good to have a sort of long form let's play to be cracking on with that I can then just add these videos to them. Uh, but I appreciate that if you're here for the puzzle games but you're not here, you, like, you're looking at Factorial and you're like, I don't care about this at all, then the content for you is few and far between and I respect that. Um, I'm not really sure what I can do about it for you though, to be honest with you, because you know, I am working full-time, mostly full-time, sort of full-time. Uh, this one. Oh, I flipping pressed the wrong mouse button again! So there's only, t again, there's only two left. It has to be one of these, and it has to be one of these. But if it were this one, it could be this one and this one. Because it has to be one of, oh, it's here, don't worry. I found it, I found it, it's there. Is this going to get harder? I assume so. Oh, I hex 
Texagons as well. And I liked Texagons before they were cool, just for the record. <laughs> um. Oh, god damn. That might have genuinely been a mistake, that one, as opposed to actually uh, wrong, clicking wrong on the mouse. But it's possible I'm just going too quickly for my own good. Uh, where are we? Uh, here. Here's a good place to carry on. Plugging away. Oh, I've done it again. It just seems weird to me that you would left click where the mines are. And I know it's not Minesweeper, I know I'm not playing Minesweeper, but that is of course what is happening in my brain, is that I'm playing Minesweeper. I feel like I know what's going on. Okay, I can get to world three now. Get to world three. Let's just let's just hurry up. Come on. Here we go. A line number tells you the number of blue cells along its line. You can left click to open a guide and right click to mark as complete. Okay. So to Metsy then. I'm curious now as to which one of these came out first. Hex cells store page. Nineteenth of February twenty fourteen to Metsy. 18th of October 2017. Okay, so there we go. That answers that question. Obviously, Tometsi has doesn't. It's not all hexagons, and it also has colours as well. And uh, yeah. So yeah. All right. Cool. This still has sound as well. <laughs> Sound, imagine that. A number inside tells you blue cells are consecutive. Ah, oh, okay. Fascinating. What? Well, why not that one then? Oh, because even a space like this is not. Okay, I was rouged there into thinking, well, if it's three, it must be these three consecutive ones. This doesn't count as a space. For the sake of the brackets. What a ruse. I should have known that because this is a one here. I've been done. There. <laughs> Brutally done. Okay. So it's four of these. So it has to be the middle three. Uh, yeah. So that's now fine. So that has to be this one. This one is now fine here. That one is now fine. It's two of these. So which are these two? It has to be this one. It's four remaining over here. If it's but if it's twos, then it doesn't matter if it's one two or one two. It has to be this one and this one, which means this three is now satisfied. There's two remaining. It has to be these two. Cool. I'm gonna need 48 to keep going. Let me take a sip of coffee. The other problem with the Let's Plays of the puzzle games is um, uh, flipping right, left clicked when I meant to right click. Is I possibly have to do editing for them, uh, which was evidenced in Portal Reloaded, which I thoroughly enjoyed. Left click. Three consecutive, but it could still be here, which is a bit of a ruse. I had to do some editing because the game was so hard that it'd be 20 minutes at a time where I just make no progress. I'd just be walking around going, ah, I can't do it. It has to be this one and this one because of this three, but also because of this rule here. But then if it's three in a row, it doesn't have to be this one. Uh, and. That is obviously time consuming as well, because I, I have to record the whole video, I have to upload the video, I have to then go into YouTube, take out the big sections, you know, I have to basically watch the whole thing 
decide which bits are not worth the effort. Uh, Reprocess it, upload it, re you know, have it go again. It's time consuming. It certainly is time consuming. It's four of these in a row here, three of these in a row, two of these in a row, in fact. And I know, you know, that's that's the job of a YouTuber, isn't it? That's that's the YouTuber's job. I don't want this to be my job. If I wanted it to be my job, I'd be asking you to go to my Patreon and join my Discord and all kinds of nonsense like that, which, you know, I'm just not going to do. Uh, unless, unless you think I should, which I don't think you do, to be honest. The, the channel is ad-free, I just do this in, in, in my spare time because I like the sound of my own voice. Banter. Okay, it's one of these two, which means the consecutive three... Oh, it's one, two, three. Okay, so it's this one. And now it's definitely these. So it's not this, which also means it's not this, which means it's these three. Hooray! Oh wow, you get loads of hexagons for, for, for these levels. I've got 46, I need 48. I thought these were counting down, but they're not, are they? Right, let's quickly get another two hexagons, shall we? How long have I been playing this for? Sorry, I switched away from the window and it muted in the background. Uh, what am I doing? OBS, there we go. This is also why I'm not a professional YouTuber. A number inside dashes or hyphens tell you that the blue cells are not consecutive. Right, what, so like this? Cool. Nice. No! Oh, that was... that was curly braces. Uh, they've got a special name, I can't remember what they're called. That was curly braces. I got confused, and I so I thought this one had to be a space. No, he's been he's been had. So a number could just be anything, right? Okay. Not consecutive, which means this one is definitely a space. So I can get rid of these. Get rid of these. Get rid of this. That one is a thing. That's the right hand side done. Could have done that a while ago. Didn't. One of these, so all of these are clear. These are fine. This one, that means that one's fine. This one. One of these for sure, which means not this one, because there's only one in this column. So then that one, not that one, not that one, not that one, that one. Hooray! What's, what's World 4 got in store for us? Achievements everywhere. This game seems to be short. A number inside tells you that they're consecutive. They're next to each other somehow, like this. So it's got to be 1, 2, 3, or 1, 2, 3, or 1, 2, 3. And in every combination of that, we know that that is a mine. But then because all of these four are definitely mines as well, it has to be this one and not these two. That's good to know. So then four of these, it's either one, two, three, four, or one, two, three, four from this side. Either way, it's definitely these three, which means it's not these two, but it is that one. Okay. Okay, right, I'm going to call it a day there, because otherwise I'm going to show you the whole flipping game. Let's see what mechanics are in World 5 and 6 for you. It's Hex Cells. It's on Steam. It's uh, in the autumn sale, the Thanksgiving sale, by Matthew Brown. I like it. I like the presentation. Uh, there's a night mode. Thank the good sweet Lord Jesus Christ, because I can't. Uh, can you imagine staring at that? Swap mouse buttons is an option. Maybe I should have pressed that straight away. Uh, it's also in a bundle with Hexels 2. No, Hexels Infinite and Hexels Plus. You get all three of those games for one British pound sterling and 79 pence sterling. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. So if you have Tometsi and you really like that and you haven't got this, that's what I would recommend. If you don't have either, you know, check out my Tometsi video. That is currently also on Steam. It's in the sale for 65p. Uh, I would say that the presentation of 
to Metsy is a bit more bare bones, but there are many more puzzles, I would say, based on what I've seen. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please let me know with a like or a comment, and if you want to see more puzzle games, be sure to subscribe. Thank you so much, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.